Hey, how y'all doing? Welcome to my living room. More importantly, welcome to my blanket fort. You know, I made this uh, blanket fort all by myself. I don't have any little kids in the house anymore, but I do remember the days when they used to take blankets and sheets and, and chairs and furniture and create these blanket forts in the living room, and they had so much fun with them. I miss those days. And I imagine people with little kids right now are probably dealing with that. They have the kids in the house all the time because of stay-at-home orders, and the kids are, are getting creative with their blanket forts. Well, Here's something that may interest you. You can actually win a prize for that creativity. It's all part of the great Wicomico Family Fort Building Competition. It's going on right now. And to tell us more about it is Jamie Nichols. She's a program director with Wicomico County Recreation, Parks, and Tourism. Hey, oh my goodness, I love your fort. That's cool. Thank you so much. Welcome to my new uh, office in my home. Was <laughs> my that awesome fort? Was that fun to build? Oh my gosh, it was so much fun. You know, it, like you were saying before, it really brings you back to being a kid again. And my husband and I did it together. Um, we have a, an almost one year old. And so his eyes just kind of lit up with everything that was happening. <laughs> yeah, I bet. Now, um, with the parks being closed and a lot of the uh, activities that you normally program being canceled, you guys really had to come up with some creative ideas, and this is one of them. Yeah, we did. We have um, a lot of uh, conference calls every week um, with the rest of my, my group and my team, and um, this was one of the ones that came out of that. Um, and really it's for us to be able to provide a great service for everybody in Wacomico County, bringing families together for their, you know, better quality of life. And also to give back a little bit because we're going to be providing a dinner, thank you to Davis Bowen and Fridell, um, who we are partnering with to the family that wins. And we're gonna have a couple other little prizes that we'll mention um, next Friday when we pick the winners. So uh, by that way, we're going to pick some local restaurants and give people some, some food. <laughs> That's awesome. So tell me how it works. What do the families have to do? So basically, you just have to build the best fort possible, um, and you can do it in a number of different ways. You just The biggest thing is to be as creative as you can be. Um, we're going to be working with Davis Bowen and Fordell, who is an engineering and architectural firm, and so they're going to help me judge these great forts. So we're going to be looking for your creativity. You have to have at least a pillow, a blanket, or a light of some kind. You can use all different types of materials. We used some rope. Um, we had some clips and stuff, some binder clips, chairs, um, lots of different items that you wouldn't think. Actually, my main centerpiece is our beach umbrella. Get really creative and pick out all different items from around your home that you could use to build a great fort. You can use cardboard. I've seen a lot of cardboard structures, so there's a lot of different ways to do it. And of course, it's a, it's a great way to get the entire family involved because I'm sure the kids and the parents, they all have great ideas. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, this is a great way for the family to connect. I mean, you guys can all sketch it out first, you know, do a little drawing and say, this is what we want to build and then figure out a way to build it. You know, that's the, that's the most fun about doing something like this is to bring your family together, do it as a team. And if you take a, fa a picture with your family in and send it to us, you get extra points. Ooh, that's amazing. So where do you send the picture? So you can send it to myself, um, my email at j, um, j nichols at wicomicocounty.org, or we have a Facebook event going on right now at our Wicomico Parks and Rec Facebook page, and you can upload a picture right there. How long do you have? So we're running for a week. So starting actually yesterday till next Thursday night at 5 p.m. And then next Friday on the 24th at noon, we'll be announcing the winners and providing dinner to that family that night. What a great idea. Jamie Nichols, uh, Program Director with Wicomica Recreation Parks and Tourism. Thank you so much. Oh, I look thank forward. you so much. We are so excited to be doing this event. All right. Enjoy your uh, your fort. I know I'm going to enjoy mine. Yeah, I will. I'll just lay back. All right. See you later. <laughs> See you later. 